It never ends. Light versus dark, chocolate versus vanilla, Android versus iPhone. In fact, it's pointless to argue which phone is better. Both have a bunch of cool things you probably don't even know about. And now you'll learn the ones that are hidden in Androids. If you don't have a fitness tracker but want to know your heart rate, you can do it with the LED flash and camera on your phone. Download a special app and press your finger to the flash. The camera will scan the redness of your finger to track the amount of blood passing through. Just don't push your finger too hard. And don't expect accurate results if your camera isn't good. There is a special app for Android that lets you set the screen orientation. You can choose between reverse portrait, upside down, force landscape, reverse landscape, and force auto orientations from the notification menu. It'll help you use your device more comfortably even if you hold it upside down. You can change display resolution on your phone just like in video games or on YouTube. This allows you to save battery power as well as speed up the work of mobile games with high requirements. You can do this on your computer, but if you have root access, you can download a special app on your phone and change the resolution without connecting to a PC. All gamers will definitely like an app that improves graphics for mobile games even if you have an old phone. This app tricks your phone as if you're running the game on a more powerful processor. You'll need root access here too, though. Android 10 features the focus mode. It allows you to block all apps to prevent messages or notifications from distracting you. Apps can be blocked separately or all together. To activate the mode, you need to navigate to Settings, Digital Well-being and Parental Controls, Focus Mode. Fill in your contact information in advance to help get your phone back if you lose it. Open Settings, Security, Owner Info. If you type your contacts in the open window, they will show up on your lock screen, helping to find you. Android developers hide many games that visually match the name of the operating system version. To find the game, go to Settings, About Phone. See the Android version? Tap on it several times and the image with the logo will appear. Click on the image again and the mini game will open. Android users can fine-tune their phones by enabling the special developer mode. Go to Settings, tap About Phone, and Build Number seven times. After that, you'll see the developer's functions. Here, you can configure the speed and quality of communication, as well as change the system appearance and more. If you own a Google Pixel phone, you can enable the Live Captions feature. It can insert subtitles automatically to any video, podcast, or audio message you play on your phone. It can even work with recorded video or audio files. You don't even need to have internet connection for this to work. And it doesn't send data to Google. Everything is installed locally. Android 10 has a tool that turns Wi-Fi info into a QR code that can be scanned with another phone. You can find it in Settings, Network and Internet, Wi-Fi. Here, you need to select the Wi-Fi connection you want to share. Then click the Share button, confirm your fingerprint, face scan or password, and your unique QR code will appear. Don't rush to throw away your old Android phone if it's slow. You can install special apps that will improve its performance. But again, you need root access, since these apps are not compatible with the latest versions of Android. Also, you can tap the Build number in the About Device section seven times and reduce the animation speed or disable them completely. It will reduce lagging and make your phone faster. Google added a hidden panic mode function in Android phones. You can quickly get rid of annoying ads in apps or the browser thanks to this feature. You need to quickly tap the back button four times and it will force return to the home screen. This feature can be activated immediately or you need to enable it in your phone settings depending on the model. Owners of Samsung phones can configure how calls are displayed on the screen. When someone calls you, you can see it on the full screen as a pop-up or turn the call notifications into tiny floating objects. How cute! Such a call will not disrupt your work on the phone. With the Android 10 update, your phone can detect if there's moisture or dirt in its USB port. If this happens, 
your smartphone will give you a notification. In addition, Android can turn off the USB port to prevent it from damage before you clear it. Now, you no longer need to dig through the settings to figure out how to set up app notifications and pop-ups. Just long press a notification and you'll see two options – alerting and no sound. You can turn your phone into a walkie-talkie thanks to a special app. Set up this transmitter with your friends, select the desired frequency, and go! If you're not satisfied with the virtual keyboard on your phone, you can replace it. You can choose one from the Google Play catalog or set up your own background image. The most unusual way to save battery power on your phone is to slow down the CPU speed manually. Thanks to a special app, you can reduce the performance of your phone to save charge or accelerate the power to the maximum to start a cool game or work in a heavy app. Google added an infrared camera so you can unlock the phone with your face in the dark. If you download a special app, you can use this camera not only to unlock your phone, but also take photos and videos in complete darkness. This feature is available by default on Pixel phones. You can set a timer to work in any app. One hour a day to chat with friends, two hours a day on YouTube, and so on. This will make it easier for you to keep track of time. If you use social networks a lot, you'll definitely like a special app in which you can try extreme chatting. The app launches only if you have 5% charge or less on your phone. So you chat with someone else and risk switching it off at any time. The dialogue becomes more fun in such circumstances. Whew. Sooner or later, everybody could grow tired of bad news we see in our feed. If you want more good ones in your life, then try a special app that offers you only beautiful and funny images and posts from around the world. No bad news, no sadness. This is a media space where you can relieve your stress and lift your mood. Really?